I don't know what take this is, but I think it's like 25. I am i can't even get my dates right. It is Angela, the Traveling Crafter. Welcome to the channel. And I am here. I was just getting ready to start my week of videos and projects. And I thought it would be a good idea for me to hop on and give you some announcements real fast because I know I don't want you to miss them and I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So the first thing that I wanted to uh, remind you of is that I have, in April we started doing play dates, live play dates featuring a guest and last month we had both Kara from Paper Confessions with Kara Mia and Bibi from Bibi's Closet Creations. And I promised you this month that we would have special guest Lori Edwards with Enchanted Dream 71. And she is going to be here. So tune in uh, live or set your uh, bell to be reminded at 3 p.m. Central Time. So that would be 4 p.m. Lori's time, Eastern Daylight Time. And then if you're in Mountain Time, that's 2 o'clock. If you're in Pacific Time, it is one o'clock. So we will be going live. The two of us have decided we're just going to craft with whatever happens to be on our desk or the project in which we are working on at the time and just chat with all of you. I'll ask her some questions. You guys can all ask both of us questions. We'll just have a, a really good time like we always do. And uh, you can grab your favorite afternoon go juice of choice and the project you're working on and tune in and craft along with us. So that was number one. Number two, I am kicking off and I have invited several friends and this is my invite extending to all of you who wish to part participate that I will be launching open collaboration called the 100 Day Challenge A-T-H and that stands for Around the Home. So I was looking for a challenge for something that I could do that wasn't just, I've got my schedule, I know what kind of uh, videos I want to do, I know what kind of journals I need to get done, and I just wanted something where I wasn't planning it. So I generated this random list. I did not write it, I just generated it um, on the computer with a random generator. It gave me a hundred different items that you could find around your house. And I have created a challenge. So every single day I will do a quick video using whatever item that is. I will use the tag 100 day challenge ATH and encourage you to grab that list and craft along with me, upload your videos either or photos on Instagram or whatever platform you wish and use that hashtag because it's going to be fun. You can find the list of items that I created not me, the computer graded, that I have put into a form for you on my Ko-fi site. So if you go to ko-fi.com slash the traveling crafter, you will find all of my freebies, a lot of digitals, and you will find that list as well. So you can print that out and follow along. But what I do promise you is that each day uh, after June 1st, I will say tomorrow's prompt will be, and then you'll know what that is when we... Um, start to play with it. Some things on the list are tools. Some things are pretty obvious. Some things are, are common junk journal tools and others are kind of weird. And I didn't change them. I just left them on the list and we'll see how we go. Uh, I am leaving myself a little bit of leeway should it be something I absolutely do not have in my house because I really didn't peruse the list deeply. But other than that, I am following the list and it will be a real short video. My other videos and tutorials for the other projects we have underway will continue on. My live sales will continue on, but we're going to do this for a hundred days. You can participate every day if you wish, once a week, whenever you feel like it. You know me, the rules are, there are no rules. Just please use the hashtag. And if you can give me a uh, little uh, tag or mention, and then I can find all your videos too, because I really like to do that. So in order to do that, and let me tell you the second reason that I did this, not only to challenge myself and to not just be all focused on my to-do list and the process, was that I needed to just kind of escape into, okay, I've got something, I need to be creative, and that's what I'm going to create with. But I also wanted to offer things up to new junk journalers. And I have, I've been blessed enough to have a lot of you who are reaching out and saying, I'm new to junk journaling and uh, I might not have all these supplies. And, and, you know, I've got some fancy stuff. I've been doing this for art all my life. 
Uh, but I wanted to take it back to bare bones and really use junk and really use the minimum tools that we need. So prior to that on uh, Monday, the 29th, which will be tomorrow, I'm going to post this one today. I am doing a, uh, what is a junk journal? And what are the elements of junk journal and how to use a junk journal? It'll just be me talking and showing. Uh, we're not crafting. I just want anybody who's new to the junk journal world or is new to my channel uh, for them to have something that is comprehensive and easy to follow and answer some of the questions that are common that I get. Then on Tuesday, leading up to the 100 day challenge, ATH, I will be doing all of the tools. So I have rounded up my must have tools, the things, you, just the minimum that you need in order to create an art junk journal. I have the nice to have items that I have on my list or things I like. And then I have the really yummy indulgences that if you want, I can should tell you what those are too. So we're going to look at those tools. And then on Wednesday, which is the same day as our live, uh, I will be doing covers three ways. So my here's my thought process. I want new, begin, new folks to the junk journal world to know what is a junk journal, uh, how to use it. I want them to have the tools that they need. And then I want them to be able to have some covers made in advance so that when we start these daily uh, challenges, those are things that can then we can add to a journal. And so I will have one as well, maybe more. And then we will just add those items throughout so that at the end, if you follow along, you too will have a hundred items that can go into one or many journals and you'll have a finished completed journal. So that's kind of, that's my hope. So with that, let me see, is there anything else? One last thing, the drawing for the, uh, turning three K on my birthday celebration is still going to happen. I do have my lap journal. I have been away with you know family activities and things and it it will be done I will be giving it away we are almost at 3,000 uh but it is not done yet so I need to either do it off camera or do some more uh, on camera videos with you and I think you guys have wanted me to do that and want to see how that paper bag lap book is going to turn out so uh just as an update we will be finishing that. And any of the other projects that I have going on, like the magazine, uh, Altered Magazine, we will continue to do that. Uh, we will continue to do uh, Index, the Index Card Challenge 2023, uh, you know, whenever we kind of feel like it. But funny, the very first item, just so you know, if you want to prep, the very first item that was generated on that 100-day list were index cards. I thought that was interesting. So, now I got to think of something else to do with index cards. But I think that that, that is it. Uh, I would love it if you gave uh, the video, this video or any video that you watch a quick uh, like and subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss all of the fun that's to come. And then, I don't know if I mentioned this. I think I mentioned the drop sale June 1st. If I didn't, it's the first of the month. We have a drop sale every every month at the very first Thursday, and then the rest are live. So just a reminder, join uh, Lori and I on our play date. It is on uh, under lives. Uh, you will get a reminder if you put on the bell, put the bell on uh, at 3 p.m. Central Standard Time on Wednesday, May 31st. So I always tell you as, uh, as you carry on through your day, remember to take time to just be, and we will talk to you soon. Cheers. Mm -hmm.